Here's how to install Continuity for Minecraft 1.21.5. If this video helps you, don't forget to subscribe and let's begin. Now guys, the first step to install Continuity is to click the second link in the description, which is gonna bring you right here, where we're going to choose game version, and then we're going to choose 1.21.5. Then you will see this file in here, which as of right now, we only have availability for Fabric, but in the future, you might have Forge or Neo Forge if you're running a different mod loader, just download the one that is proper for you. But in this case, we only have Fabric, so we're gonna download this one. Click on this download button here, and after a couple seconds, your file will begin downloading. Downloading. Now, Continuity for Fabric has a dependency, which is Fabric API, which means that we need to download this mod as well. Click on the third link in the description, select 1.21.5, and then just hit download for the most recent version of the Fabric API. And just like with Continuity, the download will begin for Fabric API right away. And now that we downloaded Continuity as well as the Fabric API, if you already have Fabric installed in your computer, just add those two mods into your mods folder and you're done if you already have the Fabric mod loader. But if you don't have the Fabric mod loader, then let's download that next. Click on the fourth link in the description. This is an article in here that will teach you how to install fabric that's only here in case this video is too fast for you guys but if you want to make it quick just come down to step one click on fabric over here click on download universal jar and the download for fabric will begin right away now we have everything that we need we have the fabric installer the fabric api as well as continuity so go ahead and place those three files in your desktop you can find those files in your downloads folder or your recent download history on your computer now with these three files in our desktop it's time to begin the first thing you want to do is close your minecraft launcher as well as your minecraft game and then double click on the fabric installer which is a jar file we should open right away and if you're having issues opening this jar file that means that you need to update java in your computer to java 21 i'm not talking about minecraft java i'm talking about java the software that lets you open these jar files okay so i'm gonna leave you guys an article in the description you already know i love articles i'm gonna leave you this article on how to install java 21 in case you need to do so to open the fabric installer once the fabric installer is open though select 1.21.5 and click install and that'll begin the installation of fabric once fabric has been installed click on okay close this installer in here and you could delete the fabric installer installer from your desktop because you don't need that anymore. Now with the Fabric API and the continuity files in your desktop left, all we have to do is add them to our mods folder. For that, open your Minecraft launcher. Once the launcher opens, you should see Fabric selected here automatically, but we're still going to head over to installations on the top and we're going to select modded in here because without modded, we actually won't see Fabric. Once you see Fabric in here, hover over it and click on the open installations folder icon right here. That is going to open a folder that contains a lot of files, but we are looking for a folder called mods, M-O-D-S. If you don't have the mods folder and i'm going to delete mine actually to show you what to do if you don't have the mods folder guys just click on new click folder and name it mods you could create the mods folder yourself if you don't have it now open the mods folder app it should be an empty folder and drag and drop the continuity and the fabric api files into that mods folder right here so just select them from your desktop and place them right here once you have those two files in here if you want to add any other mods this is the time to do so just make sure they are fabric and 1.21.5 now close this folder in here head back into the launcher and now open minecraft using the fabric loader if you get a prompt read through it and if you agree select this in here and click play now once we're inside minecraft we should already have continuity installed and if we head over to our resource packs in here we should see that we have default connected textures as well as the glass paint calling in here and if i give myself some glass blocks in here you will see that continuity is working and it's installed that's it guys that is how to install continuity 1.21.5 if this video helped you out don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys next time